What's up guys, it's Nictorious here again with another episode of my favorite Pokemon series. Today I'm going to be doing my favorite water types. Water types are actually one of my favorite types of Pokemon because I'm from Miami, so here we go to the beach all the time, so I'm always around water, whether it's brushing my teeth, taking a shower, washing dishes, just, just playing in the pool. You know, water is just everywhere. I love drinking water too. I feel like there's a million uses of water. There's also a million different water Pokemon too. Almost 20% of Pokemon are water type and I feel like it's because water is basically how organisms are made and all of the regions are surrounded by water and there's a bunch of lakes and stuff so why wouldn't there be a lot of water type Pokemon? Before I start this video make sure that you click that subscribe button so that you can see more Pokemon videos in the future and also leave a comment saying what your favorite water type Pokemon is as well so without further ado let's get into it. Number 5 on this list is going to be Melodic. I already talked about Melodic on my top 10 favorite Pokemon list, so um, if you want to hear about it more, just go on that video. But um, Melodic is just a beautiful Pokemon, and I love like its different movesets and its stats, and the way it evolves from Feebas is uh, when I was playing Pokemon, it wasn't the normal way of evolving Pokemon. You had to get its beauty all the way up to max, and you had to level it up from then. I had a level 99 Feebas because I had no idea how to do it, so it was always a challenge for me to get a Melodic, but once I had it, I absolutely loved it. Next up is Politoed. You guys already know I like reptiles and amphibians and stuff like that. Anything like squishy or whatever, I guess, or like messing looking. But I love Politoed just because it's design and how it's a little frog. Like I liked Poliwag a little bit, but I I didn't understand what Poliwhirl was. I thought it would be a frog, but it has like legs and gloves and stuff. But once they introduced Politoed, um, I actually like the evolution line a lot better because Politoed is just a really cool Pokemon and I love the way it looks. The first time I ever played Gold Version, I my first starter was Totodile, and I loved the way that it looked. It was like a little alligator, and just like I said, I love reptiles and stuff, so of course I would pick the alligator Pokemon. And then I did whatever I could to evolve it to for alligator, and I absolutely love for alligator. It was my favorite Pokemon, especially like the its blue coloring and its you know I when I was drawing it, I really liked the the way I made its mouth because of the different contrasts and colors and stuff. I don't know, like most Pokemon have the same mouths, but there was like a special connection I had when I was like painting it. So I feel like that's why Feraligatr is one of my favorites and I like it so much. After like switching out and switching back in my Magikarp, eventually when I get it to level 20, it evolves into Gyarados and I finally have like met my life goal in Pokemon. I don't care how bad Magikarp is, once whenever I play a game, I'm always set on getting that Gyarados, just getting my magic up to level 20, whether it's EXP share or whatever, because Splash isn't cutting it. I know in newer games, Magikarp has more moves, but it was so hard to get that Gyarados just because it was so tedious, you know, getting it like switching in and out all the Pokemon. So it was it's it's worth it, I feel like, because Gyarados is a I always thought it was a dragon type, but it's actually flying type. I, I never really understood that, but it's like a Chinese dragon that's like waterish. So. Of course, you know, I like it. And last but not least, my favorite Pokemon that's water type is Swampert. Mudkip is uh, definitely my all time favorite po um, Pokemon in general, but Swampert, it's just, you know, it's a lot stronger. I always love tanking everything and because um, its defense is really good and especially its special defense. So and I would never lose any battles with Swampert. And it was the first Pokemon that I like the first starter Pokemon I ever had that actually le leveled up all the way. And I would just use Muddy Water and just destroy everything. Just, Swampert was just OP to me because I would have like every other Pokemon like level 15 or whatever and Swampert would be level 100 and I would just like kill everything with it. Alright guys, thanks for watching and if you enjoyed this video then subscribe to my channel for some more content. I post Pokemon videos every week, AMVs, music videos, live shows, pretty much everything. And also remember to follow my Twitter and my Instagram as well. I also have an Etsy page where you can check out my Pokemon artwork and if you are interested in any you can purchase them. Also, if you enjoy my channel and you would like to help support my videos so I can keep bringing them to you guys, support me on Patreon so I can bring more content to you. Also, thank you guys for watching my videos and getting me to currently 300 subscribers. So, you know, I couldn't have done it without you guys and you guys are just the best. So, thanks for watching and share my videos with people as well. I would really appreciate that.